So hello guys and welcome to a brand new PS4 exclusive. It's a sort of combination between like Life is Strange, Telltale Games, with like Heavy Rain sort of combined into one big mashup. So it sounds quite exciting. The graphics look absolutely amazing. I've watched one trailer on it just to like avoid spoilers. But yeah, I'm very excited. So what we're going to do now is do a giveaway on this video. So what you got to do is leave a like on the video, leave a comment which sort of contains Until Dawn in the comment. That's all you got to do. Also follow me on Twitter. That's where I announce all the winner and stuff. So, so if the video is well enough, I'll try and give away two copies of the game, which is very cool. Um, what we're going to do now is jump into it. This is like the first AAA game of the full season. And um, yeah, I'm so hyped. Let's do it. Jesus! Oh, why did he do that for? It's the intro bit. It's not even started yet. Oh my god! I was, I was just like, I'm just sitting here casually, like waiting for the game to start, and then that happened. That's a machete <laughs> with blood on it. Oh my god, I can't believe you actually did this. Shh, shh, shh. Don't you guys think this is a little bit cruel? Oh, come on, she deserves it. It is not her fault that she has a huge crush on my Hannah's been making the moves on him. I'm just looking out for my girl, Em. Just because he's class prez doesn't mean he belongs to everyone. Mike is my man. Hey, Em, I'm not anybody's man. <laughs> Whatever you say, darling. Mike? It's Hannah. Hey, Hannah. Hey. What the living Did hell was that? that? Dad said it'd just be us this weekend. Josh. So that's the guy. It's, it's, someone, it's definitely someone outside. I have no idea who it is. So we, oh, we're controlling it. Ooh, we're in. Right. I see you can... What's that, what's that random light thing over there? Is that like what we can pick up? Let's have a little look. Aha, I can. Right, so this must be... Uh, so press R2 to pick up the note. And we can rotate... Oh, there we go. So it's a note. This is what Hannah's seen. This is what Hannah's seen, basically. Um, you look so goddamn hot in that shirt. I bet you look even hotter out of it. Wow. Come to the guest room at 6 a.m. So not 6. 2 a.m. Little winky face, Mike, kiss, kiss, kiss. Wow, what jerk. Absolute jerk. So apparently he's dating Emily, I think she's called. And obviously Hannah's got the hots for Mike. And Beth, I think, is the sister of Hannah. That's what I've seen so far. That's what I've worked out so far. Uh, who's this guy? Can I, can I... 
Wait, who is this guy? Is he that drunk? He just passed out, isn't he? Your head's going to hurt in the morning, mate. Honestly, it's going to be absolutely painful. Right, so you can look around. Let's look for objects. So this is another object we can look at. It seems to be a wine or whiskey bottle. Or something. What is it? 1794? What the hell is that, then? That's old. I think it's whiskey. I think I can see that. Jeez, Josh. <laughs> Once again, brother, you've outdone us all. Oh, that's the brother, Josh. I got your note. Glad you can make it. I recognise that guy. I know some of these guys are proper actors. Maybe we should start with a little, you know, making out and see where it goes from there. Sounds good. Oh, hell yeah. Man, he's such a jerk. Oh my god. She's taking her shirt off. What? Oh my god. It's Matt? a GoPro. <laughs> what are you doing here? Uh, Hannah. I'm sorry, Hannah. Hannah. Hey, this all got out of Just a stupid Oh man, I think that's a little uh, bit too far. Uh, personally. You guys are jerks. You know that? Hannah. She's gone outside. Okay, right. She's gone outside. Can we make a move? Do we have to go outside the door? Right. Find the others. I'm gonna. He's completely passed out, so he's be absolutely useless. Find the others. Guys, right. Go. There's someone outside. What the hell? I'm gone already. <laughs> what? Hannah. What's going on? Where's my sister going? <sighs> it's fine. She just can't take a joke. It was just a prank, Han. What did you do? We were just messing around, Beth. It wasn't serious. You jerk! Slap him! Hannah! I, I think that went a little bit Hannah. too far, personally. I don't think Hannah so should have walked off, though. Because this is... Her? Wasn't a very safe. You know, I kind of think you're the last person she wants to see right now, Mike. Great. <laughs> right, so this is a... Oh, shit! An action button scene. Oh, hello. Don't fall over, don't fall over. Oh, yes. Must be done. Right, so now I've got two options. Fast or safe. Let's go for... Let's go for fast. Oh shit, no, I pressed my button. See right? Oh, that could have gone bad. <laughs> I didn't expect that at all. Careful. Right, where next? Uh, let's go... This goes for the sound. Just don't, don't fall over, don't fall over. Just don't break any bones. It. Be safe. Damn it, Hannah. Where are you? Where is she? Where next? It's got footprints. Are they footprints? So follow footprints or follow shadow. <laughs> I'm gonna go with Let's go for footprints. I love this like butterfly effects already. It's already happening in the game. Like, we just started the game literally just now. It's already happened. Get the torch out. Oh, we could <gasps> use the touchpad on that thing. Oh, that's actually pretty decent. That's where it's actually used well. It's rarely used well, though. Right, status update. We can move this around. Right, so we can sort of. Oh, I always use my torch on my phone, like, probably too much. It wastes so much battery, but so useful. I don't think I quite realised how spooky this game was, if I'm honest. And not a I'm not a massive fan of like spooky games. Whoa, you freaking dear. Jesus, I'm all pretty quicker. <laughs> Definitely. Sounds good. Hannah? Please just call out Hello? or something or. Hello? Shit. Oh, what's that? Oh no. Do you want to pick that up? I don't know if I want to pick that up or not. Um, fine, I'll pick it up. Do you want to pick it up? I'm sure I trust these things. They look a little bit weird. I might just leave it. Will we leave it? I'm going to leave it and walk on. Let's see what happens. I don't know. I'm really worried. I'm really worried now. I don't like that sort of... Oh, okay. That's... That was like a fire or something? Like a flamethrower? Hannah! So that's the, that's the, that, those, those things back there were like a totem thing. So that's like a... 
I, I don't know what it is to do with the game. I'm, I'm sure we will interact with one eventually, but I just, it's a little bit freaky, like just, just sitting around. I, I do want to touch it. Whoa, okay. Nope. What the hell was that? Don't like this. Don't like it. That's the. Oh, is that Hannah? Please Hannah. be Hannah. Please. Hannah. Oh my god, you must be freezing. Here, take my coat. I'm such an idiot. I'm so dumb. Oh, who the fuck is this? Hannah, is that? What is it? Is it a guy? Or is it something else? Is it something else? Hannah! Oh, shit. Why does someone always fall over? I can't see what it is. Oh, the phone's dropped. The phone's gone. Oh, Jesus Christ. Why are you running? That's way. Okay, yeah, it's not good. No! No! Shit! What is it? Get out! Fuck! No! 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 Not ready! Don't have a death already! Oh, they're hanging on. No, I don't want a death already in this game. I've got to work out somehow to save them both. <laughs> Hold on! So perhaps that flame probe is actually on. helping or something. I don't know. Whoa, oh, fuck. Uh, what is that mask about? It wants to hold her hand. Okay. Drop. Let go. So drop Hannah. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. I'm oh so no! I'm sorry! No! No! We both dropped it! Okay. So you couldn't save. You couldn't, you couldn't save either of them, basically. Wow, what a start. They're both dead. As far as I know, the outcome for that is both exactly the same, so don't don't moan at me. Before we begin, there are a few things I need to make sure you understand. You see, no one can change what happened last year. The past is beyond our control. You have to accept this in order to move forward. But there is freedom in this revelation. Everything you do, every decision you make from now on will open doors to the future. I want you to remember this. I want you to remember this as you play your game. Every single choice will affect your fate and the fate of those around you. So, you have committed to commence with this game. This is significant. And I want to help you see it through. Sometimes, sometimes these things can be a little scary, even terrifying, but I'm here to make sure that no matter how upsetting things may get, you will always find a way to work through it. Hmm? All right. We will start with a simple exercise. Could you please pick up a card? And I want you to look at the picture on the other side and tell me what you feel about it. It, it is essential that you answer honestly in order to get the most out of this experience. I recognize your face. Right, so can we move around? Right, we can move around. Okay. Got gloves on. Okay. What's this? Okay, it's a scarecrow. What do you want to say about it? Like a farm, sweet corn. So, how did that picture make you feel? Remember, be honest. Hmm. Makes me happy. Makes it feel uneasy. Uh, a little bit uneasy because the scarecrow is a little bit weird. It's got a weird. I don't know. The same makes you happy. Yeah, let's be happy. Oh, that's good. In what way did it make you happy? Oh no. <laughs> I don't know. Um, it's peaceful. There we go. Nice and quiet. Oh. Interesting. That's interesting. Dr. Hill. So would it make you happy to spend the whole week here all by yourself? Um, I'd say no. It's a little bit lonely, I think. I want some sort of companionship. So I'd say no. And why is that? And you're weird. Um, I'll be lonely. There we go, see? Lonely person. Oh. 
Holy shocked. Well, there is a fine line between the peacefulness of solitude and the loneliness of isolation. This is something we need to explore further. Don't you agree? I'm afraid we're out of time for now. Until the next session, try to surround yourself with friends in a place that makes you feel safe. He makes me feel very uneasy, I'm gonna be honest. He's a very, the way he speaks and. Yeah, I don't like him. Don't like him at all. <laughs> it's a very, it's a very good acting. I give him that, but it just was like, it just feels odd. It feels like an odd character. So we're about to jump back, I guess, to the cabin. And two, two guys have died already. <laughs> Can't believe it. Today is the one year anniversary of the dreadful tragedy that took place on Mount Washington. Annie Klein, who is in charge of the investigation. Thanks for having me, Marty. Listeners, an update on Hannah and Beth Washington, the twins who are still missing. One year ago tonight, the Washington girls left the safety of their parents' lodge and headed out into a snowstorm. Foul play. Not officially, no. There is one individual we're considering as a person of interest, but his whereabouts are currently unknown. He has an interesting history with the Washington family. He had warned them against pursuing their construction project and claimed the land was sacred to his forefathers. You know, there is still the old sanatorium on the mountain. Could he be hiding there? My officers did search the grounds, but the girls themselves couldn't have made it that far. Something about that mountain seems to breed tragic events. More than you know, Marty. Well, thank you for joining us, Anne. With all the Washingtons tonight, their son Josh, on this, the anniversary of the mysterious disappearance of Hannah and Beth Washington. Well, hello, friends and fans. All right, let's do that again. All right. Well, hello, friends and fans. It's beyond awesome to have you guys all back this year. Um, first off, I gotta say, I am super excited to welcome all my pals back to the annual Blackwood Winter Getaway. Ah! <laughs> so, um, let me just let you know, uh, let's take a moment to address the elephant in the room for a second. I know you're all probably worried about me, and I know it's gonna be tough on all of us going back after what happened last year, but... I just want you all to know, um, it means, it means so much to me that we're doing this. And I, I know it would mean so much to Hannah and Beth that we're, we're all still here together, you know, thinking of them. I really want to spend some quality time with e each and every one of you and um, just share some moments that we'll never forget for for the sake of my sisters and, you know. Okay, so let's party like we're fucking porn stars, okay? Make this one trip we will never forget, all right? Yes! <laughs> I'm sorry, I would never go back there again. Especially the brother. Like, why would you ever go back?
10 hours until dawn. <laughs> and he's already. Wow. Hannah's best friend. Hello? Someone why, there? Why would you keep going after that? You just literally just got there. You can hear weird sounds already. Walk back and go home. Path to the cable car station. Sam. Why would you, I don't understand why you'd be doing this. You, you, you got something. Oh, hello, okay. Yeah, I know I can move the camera. It's all good. Apparently my PS4 hates this game. It's really loud and like really hot. It's like really struggling. Which I guess is good. It means this game is uh, a very challenging game to uh, perform. Okay. Oh, there we go. Glinting objects. So there's a note here. Climb over. Great. Oh, what? <sighs> Time to do some climbing. So I'll find a way to climb over it. On this wall here, maybe? Yep. This could be fun. Right, let's go for... Let's do go for a safe one. Why not? Safe! What's the point in Russian? Oh, shit. Sit, be safe. Don't drop. Um, jump? I don't know why I said jump for. This is That's the worst idea ever. Oh. <laughs> Man, it, it, it's that little countdown thing you hear. It's like, oh, my, it's in my head. Just pick something. Heavy breathing. Screw that. Right, so we can now move again. I'm guessing the cable car is in this direction. Anybody around here? Like it literally moves our whole head. Oh, it's a squirrel. Hey, little fella. You hungry? Huh? Don't move. Oh my god, I literally keep my controller like dead. Just don't move it. <laughs> <Woo>. <laughs> So I stayed still. I guess I have to like stay still to be silent and just like not be seen. So that'd be intense. Um, so apparently this is the objective. Oh look, it's got like uh, traits and stuff. I wonder if that improves like over time, like a relationship or a traits. She's not very funny apparently. <laughs> not very romantic, but she's very honest and charitable and brave. So they're they're quite good. They're good traits to have. I admire those. This game looks so amazing, doesn't it? You know what I think? Looks so amazing. Look at it. So pretty. Ah. The butterfly. All about this butterfly thing, isn't it? So we got the black one, which means death. We saw that one. Um, that was the one we saw earlier. The first one we saw in that sort of initial scene. Um, red means death. Dangerous, dangerous events, a loss for brown, um, guidance for yellow and fortune for the for the white one. Okay, that's what we're looking for then, I guess. Let's continue. The facial animations look amazing. Oh no, not, I guess I pick this one up, but I really don't want to because <laughs> these things these things freak me out. Right, tutorial. Yeah. Okay. Can I pick it up? Right. Let's pick it up. Let's have a look at it. So this will sort of activate something. You'll see, you see, you'll see in a second. So it's a yellow one. Okay. Interesting. So it's like a guidance one. So is that like foreseeing some events? It was like a crow. And I believe it was... Is it Josh? Not Josh. Mike, I think it might be, actually. Uh, so we have that. We have guidance, which is like one. So I guess you, are these like in like random places, or are they quite easy to find? I guess if I, if I look around the uh, the world, what the hell does that say? The pass is beyond our control. Okay then, that's not freaky. Wow, graffiti all the way up here. So you guys may have seen that map already if you, if you watched my unboxing. Uh, if you haven't seen the unboxing, go and watch it. It's like really good. It's got some really cool stuff in it. Uh, but yeah, obviously we've seen that map already, so it's all good. Uh, if you have a here, I think this is where the cable car is, though. Chris, are you here? I did see. A, I did. I did see a backpack a second ago. It's on this 
There it is. It's not good. Look what it is. Bags here. Where are you? You're not in the bag, are you? Man, that breathing is weird. That's oh, a phone. Do we have here? Pick it up. Right, uh, I'm a snoop. Why not? I'm always a snooper. <laughs> Butterfly effect. Uh -huh. Oh no. Look who it is. So it changed the story already. Something. Whoa. Chris. Jesus, man, has a crush on Ashley. Great. You scared me. I I'm sorry. Are Are you my secretary? I was buzzing. Cool. Well. Thanks for letting me know. I I can take it from here. Wow, very protective. Oh, so I found something kind of amazing. What? I'm not going to tell you. You got to see for yourself. Come on, it's this way. Where? Right around here. Going to blow your mind. Is it going to blow my mind? Okay, right. I believe you. Not. Oh, what's this? I see something flashing. Let's have a good look. Danger, danger. Oh, man, What's that? Look at Who this. found? Nice. Six point you think eight. We'll get a visit from America's height. Most last seen nineteen ninety eight. Oh come on! This place is abandoned most of the year. Nobody comes up here. Mm -hmm. So remember that name, guys. Victor. It's a Milgram. <laughs> so can I collect the clues, or is that just like automatically collected? It is automatically collected. That's good. We found a clue. Yay! Good start. Right, what have you found then? Ta-da! Pretty rad, right? Yeah! Come on! Look at these beauties! Uh, beauties is not the word that comes to mind. Why is this even here? What do you mean? W what the hell is a shooting range doing at the base of a ski lodge? Uh, dude, have you ever met Josh's dad? Yeah. He thinks he's like Grizzly Adams or something. Wanna try? Uh, no, you go ahead, Grizzly. <laughs> All right, here goes. It's gonna make a whole leap of sounds, just loads and loads. We're we trying to shoot now. Oh, we, oh, we're doing it. What if I have to shoot something? That'd be cool. All right, aim. <laughs> nice. Good hit. I was trying to hit this bottle. Oh, look at my aiming skills. I'm so good. Man, this uh, spirit or this guy is going to be pissed off. All this loud sounds. Wow, nice shooting tips. All right, I'm bad. I'm a badass. I'm going to go ahead and guess it was a wild case of beginner's luck. Nah, I don't think so, girl. One more shot. Boom. Look at that. Well... Anybody and their brother could shoot a bottle that big, that close. Uh, it's a squirrel. Oh, don't shoot that. No, I'm not, I'm not doing it. Sorry. I like squirrels. Nope, nope, nope. Not going to happen. Nope, not doing it. Sorry. I love squirrels. It's far too much. <laughs> nice shot. Your ass just got sacked. <sighs> hey, sharpshooter. A ride's coming. Wait, I'm just getting the hang of this. Come on, Chris, the cable car. Take the gun, perhaps? Might need it. <laughs> so I think the fact we didn't shoot the squirrel is a good thing. Oh, switch character. Yay. Very nice. I can't believe how good the graphics are. It's crazy. Especially like the facial animations and stuff. Man, it is. It's definitely weird coming back up here after a whole year. Yeah, I swear, the moment I got here, it just all came flooding back. Here goes fast. Hey, that's weird. Door's locked. Yeah. Uh, Josh wanted us to keep it locked to keep people out. He said that? What people? I, I don't know. He said they found people sleeping in the station one time. It's creepy. It's a little bit creepy. Right, he's got a key. It's all good. For you. Oh, real gentleman. Well, I guess is the, is the cable car coming now? I'll have a quick little nosy around here. See if we can find anything. Because why not? Apparently, it's a little bit cold, if you notice. Oh, hello. The car was Blackwood Pines. Guess we gotta wait. 
for a healthy body and mind. What a crazy place to set up house. I mean, no matter how rich you are. They're not so rich. They only bought a mountain. So there's a health pack in here. That could be useful at some point. This is something here as well. Is that the... Is that the bath? Huh? Why do you cook the bath? Well, it's perhaps like a spa or something. What if I should have kept looking at that, actually? Should I keep looking at it? Oh, perhaps I'll see someone. I'm wondering if I if I see someone like, walking along. That's where we are right now, isn't it? No one there? I'm very suspicious. Hmm. I can't see anyone. I've been looking for a while, so. What else we can look for? Keep a smashing X. I don't want to miss anything. Smash, 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 smash. Nothing, nothing that's everything. Nothing lockers. That laptop doesn't work or anything. I'm going to look at that. I'm going to quick look at it again. Just because I want to. So it's not like switching. Can I switch to channel? No, I can't switch to channel. Oh, what happened? Oh, oops, sorry. <laughs> sorry about that. Right, okay. I'm done with being uh, suspicious. Let's go. Is it not here yet? It's here. Finally. You coming? Yeah, well, I was going to stay here and catch some Z's, but okay. He's a joker, that one, isn't he? The banter. Let's get in. No kissing. Behave yourself. It's just like going to the prom. Here we go. Right. Adventure begins. Oh, I hope this was the right thing to do. What? You know, getting everyone together on the anniversary. I mean, Josh seemed really pumped about us all doing something, didn't he? Yeah, no, he definitely did. I haven't seen him so excited about something in forever. Good, good. It's hard to tell with him, and I, I don't know, I've kind of been worried. No, no, it was, it was a good idea. I hope everyone else feels the same way. We're all here, aren't we? Thanks, bro. Good talk. <laughs> you know what? Let's just, let's just stop talking about what happened and enjoy the trip. Ah, uh, you know what? You're right. You know how Josh and I met? No. Okay. Third grade. Josh sat in the back of the room, I sat in the front. We didn't even know each other existed. But the kid sitting next to Josh started strap snapping the training bra on the girl in front of him. So the teacher made him move to the front, where I was sitting. Okay, so? So I got moved to the back. And? And next to Josh. That's how we met. I mean, and became friends to this day. A match made in heaven. If it weren't for the fact that Jeannie Simmons hit puberty like three years early, and on that day decided to wear a low-cut shirt that showed off her train bra? I mean, who knows? You could be riding in this cable car alone. Right now. Or, or talking to some other person entirely. Boom. Butterfly effect. Ah, uh, it crops up again. It crops up again. So Chris is that guy that was passed out in the initial scene. As far as I know, he was like with um, with Josh, wasn't he? Like just laying there, like I'm drunk. And who's that? Jesh, Jesh, Jesh. <laughs> I can't say her name. Uh, she's trusting, and confident. Mike's new girlfriend. Ooh. Boy, oh boy, oh boy. New people. Time to meet and greet. Oh, is this like a complete new character? Okay, interesting. Right, we're gonna do now though. Is pause it here. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I'm excited to see where the story goes. So far, I'm actually in love. I'm gripped to this story. Very excited. Uh, I'm sure you guys may disagree with some of my decisions throughout the game, like I said already, but please just like enjoy it. Um, feel free to comment if you like if you do something differently, but don't be rude about it, <laughs> please. All right, anyway, see you guys later. Bye-bye.